Do you want to be able to share your screen on a WhatsApp video call? Well, then you have come to the perfect video because in this video, I'm going to show you step by step exactly how to do this. But make sure that you watch this until the very end so that you don't make any mistakes in this process. So the first step is going to be for us to come to this page right here. So go into your WhatsApp app basically and then you should be taken here. What I'm going to do firstly in here is to click where it says settings and that is in the bottom right corner. So click on settings. And as you can see, I'm now taken to this page right here, which is great. What I'm going to do in here is to just simply scroll down until I can see where it says help. So click on help in here. And then in here, I'm going to click where it says contact us. So click here because then you should be taken to this page right here, which is great. The reason why you need to come here is because in here you're actually able to directly contact the WhatsApp support, just so you know. And for them, you can explain that you need this function to be unlocked, that you can actually share your screen on a WhatsApp video call. So I'm going to write exactly like this to WhatsApp. So just keep watching. I'm going to show you exactly what to write. I want to unlock the function to be able to share my screen on a WhatsApp call. I need this to be fixed for my account. So write basically exactly like this to the WhatsApp support. I want to unlock the function to be able to share my screen on a WhatsApp call. I need this to be fixed for my account. Now click on next in the top right corner. And basically it will take a couple of minutes after you submitted this. But before that you need to actually, because as you can see, you're now taken here and you cannot click on any of this just so you know. What you need to do is instead is to click on that way below. As you can see way down below, it says send my questions to WhatsApp support. So click there instead. And then it will take like a couple of minutes for WhatsApp support to be able to respond back to you. And hopefully after that, this should be fixed for you. So basically this is exactly how to fix this. So let me know in the comments below if you have any questions and I will do my very best to try to help you. And also please leave a like on this video and subscribe to my channel because I'm doing a lot of helpful videos constantly that might be very useful to you. Thank you very much for watching and I wish you an awesome day.